what's so crazy? I literally was just talking to somebody probably 10 minutes ago, and he was just saying that nobody ever wears purple. So can I just say, uh, listen, he off this carpet at this point, but can I just say I love the fact that you are like rocking the purple family Thank today. Yeah. I am here for it. My mom, you know, and I never wear purple, but my mom is her favorite color. And she was like, you're at the NAACP. You need something that means royalty. Purple is royalty. Yeah. And my mom, that's her favorite color. It's her school colors. So I was like, got you. And this just came and I said, oh, this is great. Daria in Detroit yes. and the project that you know you've worked on like how did the project come about for you I would love to hear that first and foremost and then of course talk to me about your character whatever you can share yes so DR from Detroit it came from me of course like I did the audition initially I actually went for another character but when I auditioned for DR and the team they saw something else in me to play Aja and I wouldn't have had it any other way literally DR didn't give me that role God gave me that role because I have so many similarities of Aja and me and after that it was just smooth sailing I, and I knew that was when I was like oh I was meant to be this role Aja is that girl she is from Detroit she is Detroit's 35 under 35 she's a salon owner she stands on business she stays in designer she is Diara's best friend and um, she's also Swa's cousin who's played by Morris Chestnut she is just that girl she's celibate She's about her God. She believes that God gave her the reason why she's being blessed with all of these opportunities is because she's being obedient to him. Amen. And she's just great. I love her. If you could switch places with me right now and be the journalist in these high heel shoes, who would you want to interview and why? Oh, um, I would love to interview Regina Hall. I think she's great because I really think that I, I, it's such a compliment. Um, Jack Knight, who I was on the show Bust Down with that was on Peacock, um, we did one season and sadly he took his own life. But before he did, he tweeted, um, no, he did an Instagram story about me and he said, Dominique Perry is the next Regina Hall. And um, that was so like touching to me. So because of that, I feel like I have a connection to her. I already did before, but because of that, I really just am interested in meeting her, working with her. That'd be great. Like that's the first person pop in my mind. Before I let you walk off, what is the one word that you live by every day of your life? What is the one word that pushes you forward, encourages you to just keep pushing, pushing, pushing? I would have to say uh, triumph. <laughs> um, it's been a journey. Um, it's been tunnels that I couldn't see the light out of. Um, but God is so good, and God has made me realize that there is light at the end of the tunnel and if I just stay true and follow his journey I can get the triumph you know it's, it's just been it's been amazing that's the main thing that I can think about right now because I'm I'm in this room with all of these beautiful people you're in this room with all these beautiful people I think a lot of us are, are experiencing a triumph right now yes well, thank you so much, Dominique. You yes. look stunning. Thank Let's you. have some fun too. tonight. Oh, it's pink and purple. That it's used to be my favorite purple. color. Yes, you look so pretty. Thank you. Bye, Dominique. Bye. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.